time to check my newly repaired exhaust fan and take a look here is it now after replacing the defective parts gumagana siya guys off today i'm gonna show you on how to check exhaust fan motor first let's try to check if there is a possible ground VL green is the ground and we're going to test one by one here no continuity it's not grounded it's not grounded and let's check for the windings of this motor let's set aside the grounding white and blue no continuity white and brown no continuity brown and blue it has continuity and let's find out if this white here is the line for the fuse We must put a mark here. Here's the line fuse. Now I'm gonna show you that the fuse here and the end here is open. Papakita ko sa inyo guys na open ang fist niya. Ito. Ito yung white. At ito yung dulo ng white. Nandito yung fist natin. The fuse is inside here. So from here, no continuity. But if I'm going to check the windings without the white wire, so there must be a continuity with the brown and blue. Take a look. We got the reading now. There is the reading and we also have a reading with the brown. And guys, meron siyang reading. Therefore, ang sira lang nito is fuse. Now we're going to pull out the fuse. I'm gonna show you what. This is the fuse guys. Here is it. Now let's double check. Just put the other probe there and the other probe here, and it's an open. And here's what I got same 2 ampere, same thermal fuse. This is my replacement. Ito ang aking ipapalit guys. Tingnan niya. May reading siya kapag ito ay good. Ayan. So, if you're gonna question me why I replace with different types of fuse, it doesn't matter. Ito guys, palitan natin siya. And before that, the shrinkable we're going to insert here. Let's weld this one here. Use soldering paste, guys, in welding this fuse. Gamitan po natin siya ng soldering paste para tumapit yung ating soldering lid. At I'm not recommending to bypass this fuse, guys, as other technician does. Hindi ko po nare-recommenda na i-bypass natin ang fuse dahil ito po yung protection ng ating windings para hindi ito masunog before siya masunog, masira muna ang ating fuse kagaya ang nakikita nyo ito lang ang kanyang problema ngunit tinapon na ngunit tayo, dahil tayo ay recyclist pinurot natin at re-repair natin yeah, make sure guys na hindi magkadikit ito otherwise para na rin siyang nakarekta make sure that the to terminal it's not going to contact otherwise it's like a direct connection and we're gonna use this 
thread here came from Wise Socks. There, it has continuity now. It has continuity now. And let's before we install it back. We're going to put a little bit lubricant there. Bago natin siya install back guys, lagyan natin ng konting lubricant. Ito yung oil galing sa refrigerator compressor. Yan, konti lang. Dahil hindi naman siya stuck up. apply a little bit since the motor is not stuck up do this lubricating guys every six months in order to prolong the life of your exhaust fan or whatever fan you have with a washing type para hahaba ang kanyang buhay using this diagram guys tetesingin natin ang ating exhaust motor we're going to test our exhaust motor using using this diagram and let's power this on and here is it it's working now off let's install it back the fan blade We're going to lock it. And guys, pagkatapos natin palitan ng defective parts, testing na natin yung ating exhaust fan. And let's power this on. There is it guys, it's working. If you're new to my channel, please support me guys by clicking the subscribe button and notification bell so you'll be updated just in case I have new upload video. Thanks for watching. Until then, God bless. Salamat po sa panonood at pag-subscribe mga kabayan. Terima kasih.